morning warriors and welcome, welcome to, to the warrior, warrior news. news today is monday february 10th and we have lots of news to tell you let's get right into it my name is bianca and i'm monaisha for lunch later today we are having homemade chili with tortilla chips turkey chili hot dog mozzarella sticks with marinara sauce Wow. For breakfast tomorrow morning, we're having fiesta cheese omelet with whole grain toast and a cinnamon bun. Remember, Warriors, the cafeteria offers breakfast, lunch, and dinner for everyone. Students that are interested in dinner, please stop by the cafeteria right after school. If you have more than five tardies before February 13th, you can not come. So please be sure you are getting to class on time. Okay, Warriors, so let's get a little serious. So there will be a raffle going off at the Valentine's Dance. You will be getting a chance to win a Valentine's basket to enter this raffle. It is $1 per ticket. So get those tickets, and I bet you won't regret it. Yes, you will. Students, great recovery is currently happening. Please be sure to see your guidance counselor if you have any questions. Eighth grade warriors, if you are interested in applying into a magnet program, remember the application is due February 14th. Applications are online on the OCPS magnet program website. If you have further questions regarding the magnet program, please see Ms. Butler. Eighth graders, if you missed the high school visit from Oak Ridge Freedom or Dr. Phillips, make sure you stop by room 111 to get your course selection form. This is your chance to choose your classes for freshman year. Forms are to get back to Miss Butler. If you have a book you would like to return, you may do so at Tech Corner during your lunch. Congratulations to those students who receive applications for the National Junior Honor Society. Remember, your completed applications are due Friday, February 28th by 4 p.m. You can turn those in to Dr. Reed in the front office, even if you have not completed the five service hours. Teachers, if you have announcements that you would like to be aired, please follow Fill out the following form at tinyurl.com backslash GMIA news. As always, Warriors, don't forget to recycle your papers and plastic. Food and chip bags cannot be recycled. Please dispose of them in the appropriate bins. That's all the information we have for you today. We wish you well in your academics. Thanks for watching the Warrior News Show, only at the greatest middle school in America. And, and remember, remember, Warriors, be, be kind, kind to, to one, one another. another catastrophic backstory of Australians conflagration. A major fire in Australia reached a catastrophic degrees of 111 Fahrenheit in their capital Canberra which broke their 80 year record. The extent of their fire is known to be the size of the state of Florida. This fire was allegedly started because of a bolt of lightning. Normally a fire wouldn't start at ease but due to tremendously dry air weather season made it easier to spark a fire. As a result of these bushfires, many were injured and even killed to add the tragic sequence of events. Numerical value of an animal deaths to injuries were, was approximately 480 million or 23 times Florida's population. Most of these animals were near death situations or killed by the bushfires. Good morning, warrior students, teachers, and staff. We would like to introduce ourselves to you. My name is Ms. Butler and I am the 8th grade counselor and my office is in room 110. My name is Ms. Watford and I'm the 7th grade counselor and my office is in 210. My name is Ms. Only and I'm the 6th grade counselor and my office is portable 15. Last but not least, I'm Ms. Purdue and I'm the SAFE coordinator and my office is in 310. With all of the current issues going on around in the world, we want to remind you that we are here for you and that there are resources available for you as well as your family. We understand that many of our students and staff 
as well as loved ones, could be affected by the issues going on. We are all here to support you in any way we can. Please seek out your counselor or your SAFE coordinator if you would like to find out more information about these resources. Thank you.